Hello, and welcome to Friendship, Wellness, and Wisdom, the podcast where two friends get together and talk about a variety of different topics about love, learning, self-care, and basically whatever interests us. So welcome to today's show. I'm Rachel. I'm Heather. And this is... And uh, we're here today to uh, talk about very, something very exciting. So, but before we get into that, I'm just going to say, ask you to like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications so that you can stay up to date on all of our latest. And um, yeah, thanks. I'm going to give it to Heather and uh, we'll get into the show. Nice. So today we're doing something really cool. Rachel has just launched this amazing program. Um, it is a basic movement for beginners. It is amazing. So I actually purchased the program and I am actually going through it. I'm not completely done with it yet, but it's very comprehensive. It's very easy to follow. And we're going to go through some questions to kind of like hone in on the actual program so you can understand it a little bit better. But um, I just want you to know that Rachel has been working on this for such a long time. Yeah, and it really shows. The, the quality of it is really, really nice. It's super easy to follow, super comprehensive. And so we are going to get right into it. Um, yeah. So the first question I want to ask you, Rachel, is um, what inspired you to create this program? Okay, so two things really. Um, one, I have been dealing with uh, chronic pain and uh, fatigue for years now. Uh, and uh, I work as a rehab fitness trainer. Mm -hmm. And I work with a lot of people who have like limited mobility. Okay. So at first, I was... Um, basically changing and modifying exercises mm -hmm. to fit like the abilities of my clients. And at times though, I was running into problems where I was having a tough time, like working out and exercising because movement was just, it was a lot for me. So right. I, I, what I wanted to do was break everything down to the most basic of movements that you're going to use every day, right? So instead of going crazy and getting you into crazy positions, I wanted to start where like, this is what you're basically doing. And this is how we're going to target the main joints and, mm -hmm. you know, the muscles that we're using every day in everyday life so that it would stay easy. You know, it didn't feel like a workout. It doesn't feel like an exercise. It was basic. It was something most people could do, and it it made you feel feel good and accomplished that you were able to do the movements. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, um, I've gotten through the upper body part of it, okay. and so the one thing I do want to say about it is, if you are a desk person, yeah, you can do a lot of this stuff at your desk, um, like your shoulder movements and your arm movements and the stretching of the back and stuff. And so um, you've made it very, very accessible, which is super nice, even for not, that was, ne yeah. not necessarily for um, people that are uh, limited mobility or whatever, right. but limited space. Limited space and limited time. Cause yes. I mean, these are, they're, they're all short. Uh, they're mm -hmm. all a few minutes only. They go into, there's three rounds throughout, but if you have limited time and you want to go through and do one round, like right. this is something that if you have five minutes and stuff, five minutes for me, you yeah. can sit <laughs> at your desk, right? go right. through one round, move your body a little bit, get back to work. Mm -hmm. And then you can do the next round, like a few minutes down the, down the road or an hour down the road. And then you've still gotten the whole thing in you've stopped, you've moved your body, mm -hmm. you've looked away from your computer or whatever it is that you're doing. And it, it just really kind of, aside from giving you some movement and some exercise, you're giving yourself a break from what you're doing. And, and that's right. just always helpful right. for body, you know, for both body and mind. It like gives you a chance to breathe. It gives you a chance to clear your mind. It gives you a chance to move your body and then to kind of notice, you know, mm -hmm. what's going on with you, um, you know, in the present moment. So yeah, I thought also very 
also very important to me. Yes, very important. Um, so what what do you think uh, sets your program apart from other programs? Okay, so I tried really hard to keep it as simple and as basic as I possibly could. So many people I know, and, and myself included, when um, I'm not feeling right, don't have the ability to do certain exercises and they feel like I'm not fit enough to do this. Mm. Um, some people have no time and they're like, I don't have time to go to the gym. I don't have time to like, you know, leave my office even on my lunch break. I don't have the equipment. I don't want to buy the equipment. So I wanted to pick moves that were easy to do with limited time, limited space and mm -hmm. without equipment, but also have the ability to then add to that. Mm -hmm. So you can do a very little bit. You can do, you know, one exercise or one routine every other day. Mm -hmm. You can break it up and do like a little bit at a time. You could, if you have more time and you have more energy, you could do one or two videos at a time. It really just kind of depends on what it is you're looking for, like, and mm -hmm. what what fits your needs. And it's very adaptable, which was also really important to me. So it may work for someone with very limited fitness and ability, but it also may work with someone who is a lot more fit and active, but doesn't have the time or the space to, you know, to kind of go through with their workout. So I, I really wanted to make sure that I created something that, again, fit the, like a wide range of abilities and yeah. needs. Yeah. I can tell you, uh, going like going through it, I was sitting, I'm sitting at my desk when I um, logged in, and I'm sitting at my desk, and I'm like, okay, I don't really have a lot of space in my studio, and I'm like, hmm, how am I? Okay, well maybe I should log in for my phone and take it to the living room, and I'm sitting here, and I'm like, I can do it all right here. Yeah, <laughs> and that was right that, here. that was a big part of it. I wanted it to be able to be done in in a limited space for mm -hmm. people who. Maybe the only time they have to work out is in their office. Yeah. You know, or at their desk. And it was really important for me to um to make that a priority. That's awesome. Um, and so with each section, right? Mm -hmm. Um, you have your arms, you have the shoulders, you know, the torso area and everything like that. Um, and then you move on to the legs. What inspired you to pick the actual exercises that you picked for this program? So what I wanted uh, was to create a full body workout. So I mm -hmm. wanted, you know, to be able to hit all the major muscle groups. Oh, okay. So that when you got through it in that time, you got a full body workout. So there's six videos. Mm -hmm. um, so there's shoulders, there's arms, there's core, there's back, there's legs, and there's chest. So mm -hmm. we hit like all the major muscle groups. And again, I wanted to pick exercises that were movements that we do kind of throughout everyday life. We're, mm -hmm. we're bending over, we're reaching up, we're reaching out to the side. Mm -hmm. So these are all things that we're, we're doing in our, in our daily movement. Like, you know, you're bending, you know, you're bending your knee, you're straightening your knee. This is all stuff that you're going to do on a daily basis. And, and that was basically like, okay. I want to keep it simple. I want to keep it basic, but I do want a complete full body workout. Right. So, yeah. So I have a question that um, I didn't write down, but so we talked about, you know, the six videos or whatever. Do you see anything coming up for hips? Um, so we do have some hip movement going on and there is a little bit um, in the warm up. And throughout the uh, like exercises, but I'm not specifically targeted or focused on hips in this in the series. Okay. Um, yes, but I have I have tons of stuff that is coming out. I am currently working on putting together just like a like a, a mass of different workouts and exercises. I will be putting together different programs, so there'll be. Um, some sitting for hips specifically to work on people who are sitting at a desk all day, mm -hmm. like things you can do, um, just to change your positioning to, to open up, to stretch, to move. I'll be doing sitting. I'll be doing standing. I will be doing, um, workouts on the ground, but this seemed the most accessible 
to mm-hmm. me and a really good place to start. I figured a chair, seated exercises where we're was something that most people were going to be able to get to. So I thought that that was where we go first. Um, And yes, so I am going to be doing a lot more for hips. I will be doing it. If you go back to like, you know, some of my old like TikToks and Instagram, um, I'll do like core and pelvic floor. Mm -hmm. Um, I will be doing uh, sitting posture for back, for hips, um, and even for neck. So we'll, we'll be getting through all of that. So yes, that is something to definitely like look out for. It is on the horizon. Yay. Um, so uh, just the reason why I asked that is because uh, women, us as women, we carry a lot of stress and mm-hmm. everything in our hips. And so um, to have, you know, to have all this that you already have packaged up and to know that there's more coming uh, for people that sit a lot and things like that. That's going to be amazing. And so what is the um, ongoing support uh, for users? So after they purchase the program, mm-hmm. what what can they expect? So if you have any questions or whatever right now, and I have to delve into what I have set up. So the course is done through Thinkific. And they, they have a portal um, with an email so mm-hmm. you can directly ask questions. You can even go onto my site, which is five, number five, minutes, number four, me.com and just shoot me an email. Mm -hmm. Um, So if you have any questions about um, the videos, uh, different exercises or anything else that I am putting up or or out there, feel free to contact me and, you know, I I, I will personally be getting back to you at this point with any support that you may need. So. And then once you, um, I know right now you have the course up for how much? So right now I have the course up for, it's only 25 bucks. Um, super duper cheap. So yeah, well, I wanted to, you know, I wanted to kind of introduce myself to people. Mm -hmm. I don't have a huge following on social media and I have the, the website is new. This is, Mm -hmm. you know, even though this is something I've been doing for a while, I just kind of wanted to introduce myself, get myself out there and really get people interested in what I have. And I'm like, you know what? And because I want it to be available to so many people, I I want it to be accessible in that way as well. So I wanted to like, here's a great introductory price and You know, and I it, hope that, you know, I hope you can take advantage of it. And there is a ton in it. So not only do you have videos, mm-hmm. you also, first of all, you have a video on how to pretty much use the course. You have a video yes. on proper alignment. Mm-hmm. And then you have a video on the each each part of the body. You also have written stuff. I do. So, to, so to yeah. with it. Um, so what you're getting with that, you're going to get uh, a video for proper seating posture and alignment, because it's really important that you use your best posture and alignment while doing these exercises. You're going to get the, you know, the most out of it when you're doing it correctly. Um, I have two six week workout plans. So it tells you, it gives you a couple options and you can use the, you can use the videos however you see fit, but I did give you two options uh, for workout plans. If you needed a more structured plan to follow along with, I included a PDF that you can uh, download and print out to keep track mm-hmm. of your progress and what exercises you're doing on on what days. Um, yeah, so I can even uh, I can in- incorporate like in the show notes if you want uh, a list of everything that kind of comes with it. I think I've covered all that, but you do get lifetime access. So I made it um, once you purchase the course, you have it. For a lifetime, as long as you have the login, there's no like it's up in however long. So you can do it. You can repeatedly go back to it. Mm-hmm. It's you know it's yours to keep. Yeah, and and the other thing when you have lifetime access to something, right? As you develop or change the program, yeah, you'll you know, get all the at, updates. Yeah, at, you get all you're the updates. Get all the updates for twenty five bucks. I mean, that's like. That's a, that's a steal. Yeah, I thought that was, yeah, I thought that was a pretty good deal. So, um, yes. like, I'm really hoping people take advantage of that. <laughs> um, and then, you know, can you elaborate? So, like, there are people out there that aren't beginners, but this mm-hmm. is a great course for them. So, can you talk about different things that people could do or are you going to be 
adding things to the program that people could do to add weight or, you know, do things differently to give them a little, like as they move through the program and they develop, right? right they want more. Absolutely. Right. So there, yes, there, there will be more like coming up and I may add a few videos here and there just on suggestions for um, how to incorporate a little more resistance. Um, mm -hmm. So what I had been thinking was just like an instructional video or two just to show the movements while using weights or mm -hmm. while using um, resistance bands. And okay. it would just be like a kind of a quick like here's a re resistance band I'm using. Here's how you could apply it, you know, to the course, because once you've been through the exercises, you should safely be able to go through them. And then anyone who is already aware of or has consistently done a workout routine and who's just doing this for the simplicity of it and the, you know, the time saving or the space, mm -hmm. They can pick up. It's very easy to, to figure out once, you know, when you already know how to do that, where you could add weights. So you could just pick up um, any of the upper body, you could add weight to. And anything for the lower body could be done with resistance bands. So if you already know how to use that equipment, it's right. very easily implemented into this, That's into awesome. this routine, into these routines and workouts. And then um, we talked about the, you know, we talked about the PDFs and we talked about um, being able to print out. Can you just go into a little bit on, you know, because in there, it's like you build, you can build your own uh, way you do it, right? Mm -hmm. You can build the way you do it. So can you just briefly go through like a suggestion of somebody that's just starting out working out? Um, what would your suggestion be to start? Okay, so to start, what I would do was to pick one video to do every other, like you pick a video for one day. Mm -hmm. You do that just for that day. The following day, you either take a rest or you go for a walk. Mm -hmm. You can do a 30 minute walk. You can do a couple 15 minute walks. If you have like daily activities, like walking your dog, you can kind of count that as, as your fitness or your exercise. If you have a day where you're tired, you take a rest break. So say you're going to do shoulders day one. Day two, you either take a rest or you go for a walk that day. And then you move on. Day three, you do the arm video. Mm -hmm. Day four, you go back to either taking a rest day or you can go for a walk. So you could do it that way. You could decide to do one video a day for five days. Take the weekend off. Mm-hmm. Um, and depends on how you feel. So you want to like let your body dictate what you're doing. So if you go through one round and you're tired after one round and you don't complete the whole video, that's your workout for the day. Mm -hmm. And then you could go the next day and then just do the second round. Right. So oh. there's really, there's so many different ways to use it. Like I said, I did just put a few suggestions in. If you get the course and you go through it and you're not sure how you want to use it and you have a question to ask, send an email. Yeah. Yeah. Let me know what your concerns are. I'd be happy to kind of help you tailor something for yourself. Yeah, so. you definitely set it up like a buffet. Yeah, there's right? there's a little little bit of everything. So. Yeah, I've taken, you know, I've taken courses where they kind of like trickle the course out to you. You know, you have to like start here and go here and da 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 da. But like you have just made it so accessible. Like you can click on anything, you can go through it. Um, I went through and I watched you know, mm -hmm. just to see how long it was going to take or whatever. And then I did. Right. And like I said, I just did the upper body um, sitting at my desk and it was just so accessible and awesome. Um, and I could totally see like this just like being something that people like, oh, it's my lunchtime, popping it on. Uh, yeah. And that was that you was know? the thing because you can do it from your phone. So you can put your phone yes. on your desk. And then, and then you could just go in and do this for like a small period of your lunch break too. Cause yes. most of them are only about 10 minutes long. There's, there's a few that are a little bit longer, mm -hmm. but you could also choose to do like part of it and then go back later. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, no, it's great. It's absolutely great. So, um, tell us about your, some of your social media where people can follow you and people can get on board with. I mean, you have this course, but you have a ton of I have a ton of, yes. Yeah. I have, um, there's a bunch on my YouTube channel, which is also five minutes for me. So it's 
number five, number four. Um, so you can check me out on YouTube. I have a bunch of videos on there. Um, my TikTok, Instagram, there's tons of like shorter videos that I'll give you like one round suggestions to come up with maybe some things that you can put together on your own. There's a few like full body. I have a couple, like it's called like this week's workout mm -hmm. and it'll take you through and it'll give you like one round of like what you can do for a full week's worth of workouts. And then you mm -hmm. can then on your own adapt. Um, so yeah, there's, there's, I have a ton of stuff out there and hopefully, um, not hopefully. So in the future, what's going to happen with all of that is I'm going to be putting together basically a subscription base so that mm -hmm. there'll be all different kinds, just like these short little videos, it'll be shoulders or it will be upper body, or it will be a five move full body workout. And you'll be able to go in, click on what you want to do for that day. And then you've got the subscription. So you could go in and, and watch whatever video and change. And there'll be basically, I'll set it up kind of like a YouTube channel where mm -hmm. you do a playlist. And here's all here's all of these here's possible constructions. And that's, you know, that's the plan for the future to set it up to like be able to go on click like this is what I want to work out today like right and then you know today I'm doing a full body tomorrow maybe I want to do shoulders I don't have much time today so I'm going to do a seated chair workout just to like kind of get my body moving and but that's that's the direction in which I am heading that's awesome and then you also uh you and I have talked about you also um have blogs right so looking at the blogs, the blogs give you a lot of uh, information of why we do certain things for our bodies, sleep, other things of that nature. Um, mm -hmm. I think it's um, I think it's really great because you have uh, you have the fibromyalgia, right? And you deal with the chronic pain, and you're showing people how accessible things could be on on your good days. Yeah. Um, and then you are also showing people how to self care and take care of yourself on your not so good. Days. So great. And that's, I think that's the most important thing for, for me to put out there is like, no matter what you're feeling or how you feel, you're feeling like we all need to take good care of ourselves. Um, because the more that we do that, um, the less chance of having something like that happen. So if you, you're feeling good now, take, mm -hmm. it's even more of a reason to take good care of yourself so you can continue right. feeling good and you don't need to do a lot. It's really more of the effort of doing something with the intent mm -hmm. of caring for yourself. I think that's the most important right. um, aspect of the whole thing is really just doing something because you love, you know, because mm -hmm. you love yourself, because you mm -hmm. want to take care of yourself, because you want to give yourself the best. Right. And I think that's the key right there. Yeah. Awesome. So do you have anything else for our listeners? Any? Um, I just want to say like for now, like this is, this is what I have out there. I really hope that, you know, if you're looking for something, a really genuine place to start. Mm -hmm. Um take a look at this. I, I feel like it, it'll really check all the right boxes for you. So if you want something that's safe, effective, simple, and does not take a lot of time, like this is the course for you. Check it out. Check out the website. We'll leave some information in the show, no show notes. So you can check out the site, check out the course, check out my YouTube channel, and then feel free. Like if there's something that you're looking for, let me know what that is because I'm, I'm always looking for new things to put out there. That's awesome. Also um, make sure to follow Rachel on all her social media because she does have things that she just adds tidbits of stuff in there. And it's just chock full of stuff really. Like when, when her and I first started this YouTube channel, she was like, I really don't have much out there. And I looked at her YouTube channel and I was like, Oh my God, you have like, I think it says like a hundred videos or something. Uh, some something. of them are short. So yeah. like, I'm like, I didn't really count those. I was really counting like the full length. No, you have a length. ton of stuff out there. So, um, and it's all great information. So, so yes, um, please check it out. Yes. And we'll uh, drop all your links in the um, description as well. Great. Yeah. So, well, thank, thank you. you and have a great time. Remember to hit the bell, subscribe.
and let us know what you think. Bye. We'll see you next time. Bye.